The Lithuanian port of Klaipeda is a vital maritime trade hub for landlocked Belarus, but this port now faces economic fallout from the Baltic state's hard line against President Alexander Lukashenko. The Belarusian strongman has threatened to reroute cargo through Russian ports after Lithuania imposed sanctions against him. So what does this mean for the port of Klaipeda? Our next report brings you more. Klaipeda is the largest port in the Baltic state. The Lithuanian port handles more than 45 million tons of goods a year. More than a quarter of it comes from Belarus via the Lithuanian rail. Belarusian cargo is very important for the port of Klaipeda because they account for 30% of all the cargo turnover. But now this relationship between the countries is in trouble. Belarusian President Alexander Lukashenko has threatened to cut off the route through neighboring Lithuania. His threat comes after Lithuania and other Baltic states imposed sanctions on the long ruling strongman for election fraud. His tough talk has been backed up by his main ally, Russia. But this is because Russia wants to divert oil shipments from Lithuanian to Russian ports. Before the presidential election, Belarus had been using oil imports through Klaipeda to reduce its reliance on Russia. But since mass protests broke out in the country, Lukashenko has become heavily reliant on his single most important backer, Russian President Vladimir Putin. However, Lithuanians believe that the boycott would be purely political and would make no sense economically. Belarus doesn't have its own exit to the sea. And geographically, Lithuania and Klaipeda are in such a position that the port is the closest location to Belarusian fertilizer factories. Even though this might be more expensive, some experts believe Moscow could be willing to compensate Belarus to get the cargo and punish NATO member Lithuania. But the threats haven't changed the situation so far. The port and Lithuania's railways have not witnessed any major changes so far. Except for the fact that Lithuanian truckers have reported more thorough checks at the border. At this time the situation is stable. Status quo. Railway cars and ships are going as usual. Cargo turnover is the same and today we don't see any indications that changes are going to happen.